and they're off. Stud puppy, stutter step start, count your pennies. Broke alertly for that outside draws, racing out for the lead. So too is Saving Mama in between, Future Vision down toward the inside. So those three scrimmaging for the early lead, and it's Saving Mama with a narrow advantage. Future Vision is keeping pace in a bit tight there, backs off to settle into second. Count Your Pennies comes away in third. Orphan Haley on the outside is fourth by another two. Stud Puppy comes away fifth. Musk is down inside sixth. Master of Wars in seventh. And at the back is Strike It or Tap It, about eight lengths off the lead. 22 and four for that opening quarter mile. They're on the far turn, saving Mama the leader by a length. Future Vision has been moved outside to track the pace from second, and he's getting closer now, just a half a length behind. Count your pennies angles to the outside from third. Orphan Halley's on the far outside, racing three or four wide, while fourth. Stud Puppy over to the inside, picking it up from fifth. Master of War, sixth. Strike it or tap it. Seventh Musk is at the back, top of the stretch. Saving Mama turns for home in front by two. Saving Mama now two and a half. Count Your Pennies runs up into second. Future Vision gives way. They're at the eighth pole. Saving Mama trying to see it out. Count Your Pennies grinding away, but is still second. 16th to go. Saving Mama clear by two. Count Your Pennies trying hard, but is second best to Saving Mama. Who wins it by two? Count Your Pennies was second. Orvin Alley was third. And Master of War was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Action potential and sacks. The two of them break alertly. Let's be clears away third inside. Take the back roads. Not the best of starts. Races up on the outside. Up to grab third. Let's be clears now fourth. Grandma B wide onto the far turn. Racing in fifth. Up top, it's action potential and sacks going head to head with three furlongs to go. Take the back roads, hovering to the round side, three wide while third. Let's be clears right in behind, fourth, only two lengths to make up from there. Coming for the top of the stretch, action potential, short lead sacks right there too. Take the back roads with a wide trip so far. Let's be clears in behind, three sixteenths to go. Action potential still in front. Take the back roads on that one, brush just a bit. Sacks is down inside. Let's be clear, fourth, sixteenth pull now. It's take the back roads, action potential, and sacks. And let's be Clear joins them late on the scene outside. Any one of four can win it. Sax short lead, maybe. Sax might have held. Let's be clear. Found stride way too late, but it's tight. Then it was either action potential or take the back roads. They're in the gate. And they're off. Verb down inside. Spycraft is there. Lost in Limbo comes away in good order. Third outside. Bad Beat Brian comes away fourth and is hustled along from there. Then it's Gray attempt toward the rail. Break it two back to strike me down and Super Dormy is the trailer. Down the back stretch they go. Verb and Spycraft throw it down early. Head and head for the lead. They've sped off to lead by three lengths for the far turn run. Lost in Limbo's chasing from third. Gray attempt is fourth. Bad Beat Brian is fifth. They're now six lengths off these dueling leaders. A break of another five to Super Dormy and Strike Me Down. They come for the top of the stretch. Spycraft head to head with Verb. Spycraft on the outside, short lead, top of the stretch. Lost in Limbo is there. Gray attempt is finding stride. Super Dormy's catching up and switched outside for the final eighth. Strike me down, center of the course, one for long to go. Spycraft, Verb. Here comes Gray attempt. Here comes Super Dormy. Here comes Strike Me Down. Gray attempt comes away with the lead. Opens up a length and a half, and Gray attempt got it. Gray attempt from off the pace, a length and a half in the end. Super Dormy, Strike Me Down, and Spycraft. They're in the gate. And they're off. Woodline, good at beginning. Candy Landing gets hustled out as well. A little bit quicker is Candy Landing. Woodline keeping pace, though. Suburban Court comes on to grab third. Knocker Down comes away in fourth. Tejano Twist advances up to be fifth. Royal Connection down inside sixth. Happy Eyes is seventh. Hefner's in eighth. And Curly Tail at the back and ninth. They're on the far turn. Candy Landing going head-to-head -head with Woodline. 
and they rocket to the opening quarter mile in 21 and two-fifths seconds. They're three lengths clear of Suburban Court in third. Tejano Twist coming with a run now on the outside, moving up from fourth. Knocker down is fifth at the top of the stretch. Woodline cut the corner off the turn. Candy Landing's been hounding every step of the way, and now Candy Landing's in front. Candy Landing, the leader with a furlong to go. Woodline's back into second. Tejano Twist is third. Knocker down is fourth. Final 16th, and Candy Landing is opening up. Candy Landing clear by three down to the finish. Candy Landing streaking onto the wire. Wins it by four in the end. Woodline held second. Knocker down, and Tejano Twist. They're in the gate, and they're off. Manitowish with an alert start from mid-pack. Flags up is there. America red, white, blue. East side cool for that inside post. Punches up on through two. Up the shoot onto the main track, and east side cool comes away with the lead. Manitowish is going to be second. Flags up, up into third. America red, white, blue, fourth. Sergianis on inside, moving up from fifth. Ultimate this sixth. Perfect cut. At the back in seventh, it's a tight pack with five for lungs to go. East side cool, bounding along up top, leads by just under a length. Manitowish, with that good beginning, is prominent in the early stages. Flags up is there to the outside while third. Sergianis sneaking through down inside up into fourth. Ultimate is now fifth. And then it's America red, white, blue, three or four wide in sixth. Perfect cut is seventh. Well within striking range, though. Only about four lengths from top to bottom. Round the far turn. East side cool. Coming for the top of the stretch in control. Flags up. Cranks up the pressure. Sergianis has given more rain. America red, white, blue is fourth outside. Perfect cut is now fifth. They're at the top of the stretch. East side cool. Digging down toward the rail. Flags up. Draws up alongside. Perfect cut is late on the scene. Sergianis is now racing third. Down to the final 16th, flags up, opens up a length and a half. East side cool grudgingly gives way. Perfect cut is now third. Sergianis is fourth. Flags up is first. Flags up by two and a half, maybe three. East side cool was second. Perfect cut was third. Sergianis finished fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Good beginning for attorney Tim. So to Media Blitz, American Tattoo toward the rail. Glen County is joining them from the outside and farther out is Botswana as they head up the back stretch in for the first turn. American Tattoo over to the inside, trying to back down this early pace. Media Blitz is prompting. Glen County is close. Three wide first turn. Botswana is four wide, while attorney Tim saves all sorts of ground fifth and down inside. Artemis Eagle follows that first flight, second to last early, and job security will be the early trailer. They come for the top of the stretch first time round. American Tattoo cruising on an uncontested lead so far. Media Blitz moved a little bit wide off the turn to apply just a little bit of mild pressure, but trying to back down nonetheless. Botswana, wide around that first turn, continues on in the clear, racing third. Glen County has backed off a bit, settles fourth in behind the early leaders. Then it's attorney Tim who's been saving ground, Artemis Eagle, and job security. One circuit remaining, an American tattoo to catch. Cruising along still up top and uncontested. Media Blitz has been second throughout and continues to track the pace from there. Botswana is a little bit closer to the rail for the second turn. Nonetheless, is on the outside of Glen County. They're together third and fourth. Attorney Tim, two and a half lengths farther back in fifth. Artemis Eagle and job security. The opening half mile was a pokey 51 seconds flat, so the pace is very slow indeed. And it's American Tattoo continuing to cruise along up top. Media Blitz. Sticking right with American Tattoo so far. Botswana has been wide throughout. Glynn County a little bit closer once again. Fourth and toward the inside. Attorney Tim has given a nudge from fifth. Artemis Eagle sixth. Job security seventh. The round of the far turn. American Tattoo shaken up just a bit on the front end. Media Blitz sticking with American Tattoo still. They're rounding the far turn one, two. Botswana three wide and asked to go now. Attorney Tim circling up four wide. Glenn County set to strike right in behind. Needs to find a way through. He's going to muscle his way outside. Top of the stretch. Media Blitz coming after American Tattoo. Glenn County to the attack. And Attorney Tim is coming. And Artemis Eagle appears on the scene as well. One for long to go. Glenn 
County takes off by the eighth pole. Opening up by three. Attorney Tim trying to run up into second outside of Artemis Eagle, but Glen County is going, going, gone. Glen County works on a perfect trip to score by two and a half. Artemis Eagle was second. Attorney Tim was third. Tight fourth media blitz or job security. They're in the gate. And they're off. Fort Knox mid-pack breaks okay. Tomatadu is showing speed angled off the rail. Good juju. Not far behind either. Into the clubhouse turn. Tomatadu for that inside post. Angles back down toward the inside, setting the pace. Fort Knox runs up into second. AK Safari's keyed up and in tight toward the rail while third. So too striking a pose in between ourselves fourth. Good juju comes away fifth. Old Minister down inside six beach walkers seventh. The trailer is Parrot Head. The leader is Toma to do. Hitting the back stretch run in front by a length. The opening quarter goes in 24 and two fifth seconds. Fort Knox creeps up into second. AK Safari's been in tight and hard to control every step of the way so far. Trying to settle down third toward the rail. Good Juju continues on in the clear while fourth. Striking a pose right in the thick of it, racing fifth. Bold Minister sneaking through down inside sixth. Beach Walker seventh and only three lengths off the lead. Parrot Head is wide for that far turn run. Tomat to do, still the one to catch. Three and a half furlongs from home. Fort Knox is pushed on for more speed now. Good Juju's asked to pick it up too. AK Safari's given more rain toward the inside fourth. Bold Minister trying to sneak through down inside fifth. Beach Walker circles up to the outside, striking a pose in behind them. At the top of the stretch, Toma Tadu has to fend off Fort Knox and Good Juju and Beach Walker. AK Safari's in behind, striking a pose down the side of the track. Bold Minister flattened out down to the final 16th. Good Juju and Fort Knox. These two come away with it. Good Juju short lead. Fort Knox fights on, striking a pose up into third. Here's the wire. Good Juju scores. Good Juju by two in the end. Fort Knox was second. Striking a pose was third. And Beach Walker fourth. And they're off. Harford made a left-hand turn coming out of the starting gate. Happy American veered in toward the inside. Dak Daniels breaks alertly. So too does Encourageable. And Harvard's going to show speed down toward the rail. Those three across the track. It's Harvard with a short lead. Dak Daniels runs up into second. Encourageable on the outside is three wide, moving up from third. A break of two and a half back to Clayton the Lionheart, who settles in toward the inside, racing in fourth, reserved at that point. A break of three back to Friars Road. Happy American has been moved outside, and it's about five lengths off the lead as they move around the clubhouse turn. And it's Harvard in front, in front by half a length. Dak Daniels with mild pressure, if that. Backs off just a little bit more now. A length behind, running along in second. Clayton the Lionheart, third toward the inside. Encourageable, given a bit of a reminder there in the outside, racing fourth within three lengths of the lead. Happy American sneaks up on through between horses, and at the back is Friars Road. Pretty tight pack, though. The opening quarter goes in 23-2 and two to a 47-3 and three moderate half mile. There's four furlongs to go, and it's Harvard in front. Harvard heading for the far turn. Dak Daniels, though, cranks up the pressure. Here comes Dak Daniels coming after Harvard round the far turn. Encourageable is three wide and pushed on for more speed. Three furlongs from home. Then it's Clayton the Lionheart racing in fourth. Happy American under pressure while fifth. Friars Road is at the back in sixth. Coming for the top of the stretch. Harvard at the top of the lane in front. Dak Daniels draws alongside. Clayton the Lionheart pops outside from third. Friars Road is picking it up from the back of the pack. Switched outside for the final eighth of a mile. One for long to go. Harvard in front digging down deep. Dak Daniels on the wrong lead trying to get by. Clayton the Lionheart and Friars Road. 16th to go. It's still Harvard in front. Dak Daniels, Clayton the Lionheart can't get by Harvard. Harford, the winner in the end. Dak Jenkins was second. Clayton Lionheart was third. And Friars Road was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Ransack at mid-pack, bounces out on top, clear for action, is keyed up outside. These two head and head in the very early stages, a break of two back to Framaro and Kurilov, who come away together third and fourth. Ransack's in front, bias the first time, steps out to lead by just under a length. 
Clear for action is prompting from second. Kura Love is down inside, saving ground while third. From RO, three or four wind into that first turn, fourth. Overzealous comes away fifth on a spree. Settles in sixth. Stock deal seventh, and Tizza Runner is at the back in eighth. But it's a compact field heading for the back stretch run. In the opening quarter in just 25 seconds flat. Pace is slow to develop, and it's Ransack rolling along up top. Leads by a length. Clear for action. Continues to track the pace from second. From Aro continues on in the clear. Cruising along while third. Kurilov is coasting along inside and fourth. On a sprees and behind that first flight with Overzealous to his outside. They are together fifth and sixth. Then it's Tizza Runner and Stockdale at the back. They move for the far turn where Ransack hits the far turn run opening up. Now it's a length and a quarter. Clear for action under pressure. From Aro continues to hone in with a three-wide run. Kurilov continues on, covered up inside fourth. On a spree fifth, Tezza runner. Only three lengths behind. Then it's over Zealous. They're at the top of the stretch. Ransack turning for home, still in front. In front of length and a half. Kurilov is boxed in toward the rail. Clear for action, fights on. On a spree's asked to go now. Tezza runner, but Ransack is rolling. Ransack by two, now by three with a 16th to go. On a spree's finding stride. Tizza the runners coming on late. Ransack desperate for the wire and gets there. Ransack wire to wire over Tizza Runner on a spree clear for action and Kurilov.